Now we're here today with Taylor from Hawk Performance. Now we all know Hawk for your brake pads, but obviously you guys are rotors and you do more than that. Tell us about Hawk, man. How'd you guys get started? Where are you guys from? So Hawk Performance is headquartered in Solon, Ohio, just outside Cleveland. Um, we have a really strong background in aftermarket friction material in high performance applications, agriculture, mining, everything all the way back to the 1960s. So the Mustang, well the performance parts I should say end of it is a smaller part of Hawk. That's not just what Hawk does. Exactly. You guys are much, much bigger than overall than that. Exactly. So we leverage that experience down to the street. And how did Hawk begin? I mean, who, who owns Hawk now? Is the owner still involved? I mean, how did the company start? So Hawk was founded in 1993 as part of a Carlisle Brake and Friction. So right now it's based, all of our Hawk pads are made in Medina, Ohio. So everything, uh, how about your rotors and other parts you guys are into? Tell us about your rotor brand. So t we launched the Talon rotor line last year. They're made in North America. Uh, they're available in many popular applications. This one is uh, for the Mustang we're gonna work on later today. Now, is there any kind of proprietary technology that Hawk runs or patents or things that, you know, what, what separates you guys from your competitors? I think it's really our, our research and development facility. We have over 20 dynos. We have a team of engineers that are working every day to develop new friction material. So we really leverage that experience we have in each compound that we offer. Now, what's the benefit of a dyno for brakes? And obviously, when we think dyno, we think horsepower. What does it have to do with stopping power? So we're able to replicate nearly any situation your car may see on the street, any type of vehicle, any racetrack. We can really replicate any type of situation that that compound can see. So as far as the Hawk brake brand itself, do you find that, I mean, are you more street? Are you more race? Or do you find that the race technology maybe trickles down to our street cars? The street market is very important for Hawk performance, but we definitely leverage our racing and motorsports pedigree to let that technology and experience trickle down to the street. Now, when it comes to compounds, I mean, obviously we've talked about some of the standard compounds you see on your street car use, but I'm assuming you guys have some crazy stuff that you build for the race car world. Yeah, we have some extreme applications. I mean, road course stuff with cup cars, rail dragsters, everything in between. And beyond cars and motorsports, I mean, you guys, I'm assuming, do you do like heavy truck? Do you do, I mean, what other things is Hawk into? Oh, exactly. A million pound mine truck driving down a mine site. We make the brakes for that. Aircraft, everything. And what's a brake like that look like? I mean, is it like time fit on the table? Yeah, not? this brake rotor would be almost five feet in diameter. Holy crap, we need to get one of those in here. <laughs> so we knew Hawk, obviously, for brake pads. Now you guys are in the rotor market, in the fluid market. What does the future hold for Hawk? Where are you guys going to go next? I think we're really looking at anywhere on the vehicle with a brake system. So looking at calipers, lines. So at some point, maybe a full brake upgrade system from Hawk. Yeah, I think in the future, it's definitely a possibility. Well, if you're looking for rotors, pads, or fluid for your Mustang Focus or Fiesta, all the Hawk stuff's available at cjponyparts.com.